post is slate. We'll slate it. Fight pods! Ladies and gentlemen, we are here live in the Palisade studio. The ocean's that way, if you're wondering. That's a very special guest, Die Ocean. Well, the ocean's always here, just. Yeah. No, no. But it's not, always a guest. Yeah. It's always the a guest. The camera's the guest. The camera, all the camera's the guest. Okay. It's our first time we're recording this, uh, with that thing with the camera right there. I it's, think I'm going to be watching myself more than the fight. The whole tonight. time? Yeah. yeah. I'm Steven Evans. I'm Carmine Pelle. And I'm Brian McGuire. Oh, no, hang on. We fucked that up. Oh, I'm Carmine. That's right. I'm Brian McGuire. I'm Steven Evans. And then what did I say last time? You got Brian, it. Oh, I did it right. You I'm actually Brian got a Maguire. name right for once. I'm Brian <laughs> it was Maguire. the first time. <laughs> first name I got right. right. That's very good. And uh, Phil be, Davis. behind us, though, we have our my lovely wife to be, Miss Jenny Lay. There's her hand. That's right a there. hand. It's a beautiful, steady hand. and wise hand. Best Jenny hand Lay. of the three of us. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. And, uh, what are you bringing in the Steve? bread? Bring the bread plate so in. Phil Davis is in the ring. And Phil Davis is circling the ring. And drink some wine. He looks like he's in good shape. Yeah, so I gotta he get does, some yeah. cheese. He looks better lady. than the last time I saw him. He looked kind of strung out on heroin. I was gonna say the opposite. He looked kind of like uh, like a lot of uh, Fat a lot of potato pancakes or something. You know? Uh, potato pancakes. I don't do it to you. I really won't. So yeah, Phil. Dave, this is a fight. This is like this is happening. If you're watching this for the first time, so are we, because this is the first time we've recorded. Yeah, you know, this is it. Yeah, this is this inaugural. is like we've we've come into the uh, modern age here. Yeah, we thought you should see we had faces and bodies, and we weren't just floating heads. Yes, lots going on in the UFC these days. I think. I mean, lots of cancellations. Yeah, yeah lots bites. of crazy shit. Mm-hmm. Was, uh, um, Cane, cocaine's out. Cocaine Velasquez is out. Sanchez, Sanchez out, gone. Lawson out, Lawson's out, um, and Connor Johnson somebody out, Dennis Silver, yeah, lots of changes, man. Why didn't why isn't Connor just waiting? He's there in Brazil. Why isn't Connor fighting Glover Teixeira right now? Why did they fly into Brazil? Question. Huh? Why did they fly him? Is that like a normal right. thing? He like, gives the best blowjob. He did like the Q and A. For the crowd, and he, you know, as Connor says, he's like, the they brought me here to hype this fight. They need me to sell that's fights. Just, I sell awkward. tickets. Yeah, that's really weird. That is really awkward. Glover okay. looks good. He's a, he's a sexy beast. He looks like a Mortal Kombat character. I put See, that's how I'm going with him. You're going with him, yeah. <laughs> just because he looks like a Mortal Kombat character. He really does. Who did you play as, as in Mortal Kombat? Uh, Sub Zero. Raiden. That was Raiden. Excellent choice. Thank you. Sub Zero is the blue ninja, right? Yeah, the blue ninja. It was cool. The scorpion's yellow. Yeah. It's very good. And did you hate Scorpion? Did you want to, like, kill him? No, I really uh, hated Raiden, actually. Oh, yeah, because he was so good? Oh, now he's cheap. Raiden? I have, I have lost both of you. I did not used to play In America, we have these things called video games. What is and this? It's a video game. Do you need electricity for this thing? It's kind of like shuffleboard, but... Whoops! You gotta open a bottle of wine, guys. The That's Palisades so keeps Palisades. us I think we should watch the Steve yeah. open it. They're, they're, they're starting there. to watch me do that. <laughs> start, yeah. Phil, Phil very looks opener. so nice. He looks like a nice person. Phil, yeah, he looks it's like he should be a comedian. Like, you know, you're yeah. just telling you jokes. We're not talking about Phil that features on Five Punch once in a while. He looks like the bread, the bread coming in. Phil looks like. <laughs> Did we get that on camera? You're yeah, almost breaking the bread, literally. Yeah, yeah that's on camera. Cool. It's this uh, Jewish this nomenclature, is, you know, right? Sometimes we Break talk bread. about the Break food bread. on the show and yeah. nobody yeah, ever believes us. Yeah, we have but it. We actually do eat. Um. Phil yeah, Davis is a pretty significant <laughs> underdog for this. I didn't think he'd be that much of an underdog. Oh, is he a big undie? I'm still trying to... Who did he fight enough. after Anthony Johnson? He didn't yeah, have one fight. I don't think he has fought since Anthony Johnson. Has he? Who? Phil Davis. Did they? I don't know. Check the stat boards. The Check Metro PCS stat board. 
take this time to thank my sponsor, Malibu Family Wines, as Brian Pours. Yep, that's this um, came all the way from the family. Thank you very much. I'll what are the oldest families? Years? I'll take in the county. my time to thank my sponsor, um, Phallic Shaped Objects. Hmm. Any phallic shaped object will do. Thank you. You will do for what? Uh, for my sponsor. Oh. I'm just sponsored genuinely by Look at concept. Bill Davis's picture for his wiki. <laughs> oh, my That's God. Pimp. Can we show the people? Let's turn up the brightness on the phone here. Here's Phil. Oh, gosh. It's nuclear. Oh, and they're starting. Oh, they started. Four minutes, 56 seconds. This is the real deal. And his middle name oh, is Quabina. Don't Sorry. blink. You could miss it. That's some wow, good that. takedown defense by Glover Tijer. Yeah, yeah, yeah it is. He is. He, he is, is a big. big he's he's big an animal. He's a light heavyweight. Record. He's a big animal. No, his last fight was Johnson. I went to eat a piece of bread and cheese, and now I can't take my brain or my eyes off the screen. I know, it's really hard to podcast, eat, and, oh, talk, and watch I'm a garden. big Clover Tejera fan, so I really have... This is the fight that I'm watching this for. Mm -hmm. This is what all the marbles... This is what it comes down to. And that's just a fight. Is what? Rock what are you saying? Let's all do that. Oh. This fight is like a... I mean, it's a... Because one of them is red. Higher than the other one. Mm. The cheese is mm. good. Oh, oh. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Yeah. Phil Davis, high kick. He's a big guy. Hoop, there it is. They always chant Hoop, that. There result. it is. Come on, Glover. Hit him with one of those. Even though my eyes are watching the screen, I still don't know what's happening. My phone is ringing. It is Phil. Phil, Phil Davis Phil is calling Phil, yeah, in. He's calling. He's calling in from the Hollywood Forever Cemetery? Yeah. Oh, Phil. Phil, you're live on air on speakerphone in the Fight Pod studio. Hello, Phil. Hey, Phil. Uh, I'm in the studio right now. That's right, buddy. Yeah. We're live. We're well, calling. Uh, I just want to say, uh, I'll say hello to all the fans out there. I'll, uh, I want to say uh, thank you to Skittles for the sponsorship. That was me ending the call. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for calling in, Phil. Thank you, Phil. Our thanks, first Phil. caller of the night. Phil Davis, ladies and gentlemen. Phil Davis. Well, we'll while he's fights. fighting. Yeah, it's really impressive. It's quite genius. This corner, we're able to mic him up. Um, it's a pretty good fight so far. Am I just invested in this one? That's why I think it's good. Are you invested? Oh! oh yeah. Front kick to the face front by Phil Davis to Texera Glavera. Absorbed by Mortal Kombat. Right, Phil, he's going to take down again. He got his neck. He's got his neck. How dare you hang up on me? <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? There was a signal in the Palisades. It's shaky, Phil. Nothing My bad. That sounds like a bullshit excuse. <laughs> it's the Palisades, man, you know. You know how it is. You've been to the studio? You know how it is. You know how it goes. We miss you out here in the Palisades, Phil. Yeah. You're not saying words anymore, Phil. You called back for cash. this? You called back for this? Is that true? That's horseshit. That's horseshit. <laughs> Glover, Glover trying to get your team on Phil. He's got out, and now Phil's on top. Phil is on top, I'm isn't he? I'm not for these allegations. We're not, it's not all about you. This is still round one. You know what, this is like Larry Flint versus USA. I will not stand for this. If these two were fighting you, one of them would sit on you and you'd just get lost in their asshole. Well, your, your, your shoes untied, Steve, for a second. <laughs> That's um, true. I'll call you after, Phil. Thanks for calling in. Okay, fine. Love you, Phil. Oh, Phil, any last words for the uh, Fight Pods fans? Uh, any words, Tom? Uh, let's say I love him. Yep, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> how does Phil... How does he... How does Phil call in? Does he have like a Bluetooth thing or something? I mean, like, is... Yeah. Is it in his ear? It is in his ear? I see. Glove is trying to bite it out right now. Tyson stopped because he loves yeah, Tyson. Yeah, he loves Tyson. And who doesn't love Tyson? I don't right think my, Yeah, I don't think my dad likes Tyson. White women don't like him. Is that what he said? <laughs> <laughs> more like, wah, wah. Was it like in the testament? Like his, his, his the wife old like testament. went across the room? He didn't just punch her? Was like, yeah, that oh. was in the Old Testament. <laughs> <laughs> that was King James version. 
So the fight six. got less interesting when it went against the cage. Oh, you mean when Phil Davis started winning, it got more interesting? Yeah, Phil, go, Mr. Less Wonderful. <laughs> That's his nickname, is Mr. Mr. Wonderful. Mr. Wonderful, yeah. yeah. Oh, no nice. Wonder. I said he looked him. nice, and now his nickname is Mr. Wonderful. Oh, he's, oh, wow. he's mauling him. He's mauling him. Yeah, see, that's this is where Phil shines. Even Phil Davis, he has the same sort of ground game as John Jones. That that ability to like keep his center position on top of somebody when on like this is his bread and butter right here. Yeah, just mm. punching the guy when he's on the in the ear over and over again while he's on his the ground. Saved by the bell, Glover is. When I wake up in the morning, it's all right because he was saved by the bell. It's all right. <sighs> It's true. Mm. That was that was nice. Guys. I like that. <laughs> I, every time Why I hear something so about, dark on the screen. Um, oh, it's just. Oh, we're in a theater. We are in a theater. Oh, it's a little movie theater. That's really cool. It's gonna be really great to sit here and watch this in the same positions, <laughs> watching us. Watching, watching us. us. Yeah. That that would be fantastic. Watching That's... us, watching fighting. Oh, there's that front kick. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Glancing with that right hand. There's an uppercut. Yeah, it's just a mauling. Round one to Phil Davis. No yeah. question. We'll give it to Phil then. There's Vito Belford. He's got a huge mohawk, a wide He's mohawk. He's saying he wants the belt. Well, you've got to fight somebody to get that Vito. You've got to stop taking crazy drugs to fight anybody. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't do LSD, does he? <laughs> That'd be crazy. I will fly at my opponent. <laughs> Just take Send a bunch his rainbow of into oblivion. Acid before he fights. <laughs> I get it. Come on, Glover. You've got this. You have my heart in your hands. Use it to punch him in the mouth. I, I've always enjoyed that Mr. Wonderful wears pink shorts every time he fights. Usually it's a Speedo, but I think uh, Dana put the kibosh on. Yeah, like I think he brought out some pair that was like, all right, you can't, you can't do that anymore. Do you think uh, Dana would allow Conor McGregor to wear a speedo? I think so. I think so too. He probably made him wear one last night. A kilt. He could <laughs> wear a kilt in the ring, I'm sure. I think he could wear a midget around his waist in the ring and still get. <laughs> True. It's like a a midget. Or two midgets tied around him like a loincloth with like a frayed rope. Yeah. That's true. Too. Davis was hurt by a left by Glover then. I missed it. Is he, that what he, 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 he wasn't rocked. He was oh, just he just felt the punch. I thought like when uh, they just fell to the ground there, Glover's hands brought out that way. I thought it was his mouth, his mm. entire mouth. His, his entire mouth. mandibles just, just separated. Yeah. I was wrong though. No, oh, unfortunately. Or fortunately. Fortunately, because I like Glover. Look Whoa. at that. Glover's reversed him. Glover knows how to wrestle choke. all of a sudden. This a strong move. That was good. Yeah. Because up until then, it seemed like Phil was just kind of pushing him around. Strength wise. Get back up. Ooh, they're up again. Yeah. Spinning See, back kick. 330 left in round, round two. Yeah. This can be hard to submit. I wish this oh. was a five round fight. Mm. I do. Yeah, it seems you like think it's going to need it. I think if the the red they're going right now, I don't think anything too decisive will happen after. After you three. don't think somebody's gonna get lucky at this kind of pace and, and catch a bad shot to the eyeball. I think Tejero's got that power in his hands, and so does Davis. Anything could happen. I went to the dentist uh, this week just for the f just to hang out. No, to get some work done. Nice. And uh, like... Like you work on your script? First time in 10 years. No, <laughs> no. Like, I needed... I had, you know... You know I had a, some ideas An emergency bipods? one I had to deal with. But... Why your teeth was While in, and they were doing the cleaning... Your teeth had fucked They took off what the dentist called the Great Wall of China of plaque. Like, what? under the front of my... I had no idea. I thought it was sure my tooth. you sure it wasn't just you? No, I thought it was my tooth. The Great Wall of China of plaque? No, I'm telling you, man. I had some, <laughs> gross, man. It was disgusting. It was awful. But now I have like this whole new area in my mouth that I didn't even know existed. Wow. Well, back to the fights. So, um, the which is still sponsored by Metro PCS. Phil Davis has got him by the back. Phil Davis does have him by the back. Very Glover's fun. defense here is pretty fucking solid. Black Turns belt jujitsu. That's that. That's that jujitsu sneakery. And that is a technical term. Yeah, jiu-jitsu sneakery. 
I think my Uncle Brian is drunk in New Orleans this right This bread now. is fantastic. It really it is. is. It's hard. I want to eat more, but I want to be able to talk. But I don't know if I'm adding anything to the podcast anyway, so... Yeah, well, this fight's kind of fun. Oh, Carmine. I was I talking know, about... You never do. I was talking about... The new boy. I gotta take the crust off. I wasn't though. talking about you what so you I brought had. The stuff the oh, thing. so that's why you can't... I was having a dialogue with Joe Rogan. Yeah. You were having a dialogue with Joe Rogan. He wasn't just shouting at you. Oh, he's not? <laughs> oh. What happened? Somebody did something illegal? Oh, uh, it looks shot. like an eye poke. Oh, an eye, eye poke. Same thing. <laughs> same thing? It looks like he's taking a shot at eye poke. It's the same. Glover's Sometimes. taking a dump. It's... Oh, he's cutting his thumb off because of that. <laughs> Punishment? <laughs> yeah. We're Punishment. fighting out of <laughs> Singapore. <laughs> a tooth you a broke tooth. the rule? Yeah. You lose a thumb. Oh. But that's a punch. What the hell? You can't punch somebody anymore? Yep. The sport is lame. <laughs> lame. Come on, Glover. It slowed down. Minute left in what, round two. What, the fight or the podcast? <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a lot of bread going on. It's not my fault. There's a lot of bread, but it's, it's delicious. Really good. It's, it's giving us it fuel is. for the main event. Yeah, we're we just warming up for the main event. Guys. Jose Aldo kick Mendez's thigh for five rounds. Oh. Hmm. I, I, I love watching a good thigh kick. Do you think it's going to go five rounds? Of thigh kicking. Yeah. Well, I mean, it is GSP versus Melendez. It's like right? watching a workout video. He's just doing reps. Like, ah. It's just like kicking. GSP versus Melendez. Is it the most boring fight you've ever seen? No, that's the main event, right? GSP versus Melendez. Because <laughs> essentially, a held out is GSP. You yeah, can't finish yeah, people. Oh, well, they both, take down by Phil Davis. They both can. Back to yes. They both can knock people in their day, but they don't. Yeah, not as soon like they fight safe. Like bee hotches. And that's what I loved about what Connor said. He's like, I don't care. That's I, I guess it's easier to say when you're climbing, right? Mm. When, well, you're yeah. Yeah. when you're the champion, things start to change. Well, what are you saying about Connor, you guys? You have doubt. Well, like, I was trying to give him I credit for Connor. knocking people that's out, right. but, like, mm-hmm. is that. I, I would never done it. Was that the end of the first round or the second? Second. Wow, I missed it. It wasn't that good. I oh, gave it to Phil. Yeah. Yeah. I think I think Glover needs to finish the fight. And Phil does too, if he wants to win. Because if he gets knocked out or submitted, it's it for him. Really? <laughs> it's true. <laughs> This is the truth of the matter. So, like, you Glover just facts. lost to Bones, but if Phil wins this fight, does he have a title shot? Well, he didn't just lose. I mean, he just got out of round two with, um... I'm sorry, I'm... All right. I'm going to reset. Fight by Hans! Welcome to the Pelsay Studio. We are here live watching Phil Davis fight Doug Glover. We're just about to start round three, if you're confused. We are jumping into the final round. How's your week been, man? It's been good. It's been a solid 7 out of 10. Oh, hell yeah. I've had one distinctly average day, and then the rest of them just much worse. Mm-hmm. So does Glover uh, Sarah, me. <laughs> does, does Chuck Ch- Chuck Sarah just start doing like Chuck Liddell, like try to throw the big punch now the whole round? Chuck Zara? I think he has to. I think he has to throw that punch. Davis is too slippery from to submit him right now. Every oh, time he's gone into yeah, some kind of so submission, up. yeah, he was just a sweaty man in a mm. pink tight. Oh, and is he rocking his shorts like New York style? Like one, one one's one. higher than the other. Yeah, yeah. Do you notice that too? It's kind of a. Oh, it is. Yeah. It's like New York style, right? Why is that New York style? Well, yeah, that's how they would do the sweatpants. You know, one up, one down. Oh, like the hello, cool and the hip hop world. Used to tie yeah. one leg up. I used to do that. Yeah, that was that style came from New York. Man, it, Take out my Phil Phil's just been dominating this fight. He's been doing nothing with it, and this is why I get annoyed by Phil Davis. Yeah. yeah. Why is he called Mr. Wonderful or something? Because he named himself because he likes himself more than his mother does. Mm. Whatever you want, you can call yourself these days. 
sponsored by Metro PCS. You can call yourself that. Do you earn a nickname in the USC, or you come in and fill in a blank and like the uh, they're like you can the application. You can write it, change it, whatever you know, no however you want. Way. You're like, oh, I'm Mr. Wonderful. It's pretty much how that went, I think. Um, here in the Palisades. I like his personality though when he talks and says he's funny. And stuff. He's kind of but like. He's only just shown that he has a personality in the last few weeks. Like, let's be honest. I haven't seen him in the last few weeks. Have he's just stronger. He's throwing. He's throwing, since... he's throwing Glover around. Yes, yeah, so being so hard on me. <laughs> so hard. On oh, me. Brian's yeah, not upset okay. now. You don't want an upset Brian. You want a happy Brian. <laughs> <laughs> I hope Phil didn't punch him, punch him, take Phil. it too hard. Do you think Phil's going to get a finish? No, Phil Soulier. Our first oh, caller. that guy. Sir Phyllis. Sir Phyllis. Phillard. Philium. Philium. I, uh, I hope he took it just hard enough. <laughs> Bring him down a peg or two. I'd like to give it hard to Phil. Yeah, I know you do. Oh, taking shots. I thought your Phil. mouse cursor was Two missing tooth. Two minutes, 26 seconds. Glover has to do something. Gentlemen, I think we've seen a pretty basic, oh. technical, boring fight that from works. Phil Davis. That's, Phil if Davis. you're watching the video yeah. instead of the fights and you just watch Brian Burp, that's the most exciting thing I've seen tonight. So. He, well, Phil is winning this properly right now. The Maldonado fight was also boring. Yeah. Yeah, but... Maldonado did get a stoppage. Shaka laka, shaka laka. Phil trying to throw him. Is he gonna get it? Nope. No, Glover's but Glover's takedown defense has been just, solid, consistent. Except it, he's gotten taken he's down a Phil bunch Davis. of times, though. He's but who hasn't against Phil Davis? I haven't. Well, when was the last time you fought Phil Davis? It's been it's been a long it's been October a while. October twenty twelve. Probably twenty twelve was when I broke my arm. Oh, yeah. And I kept fighting through it. Because she got taken down? No, I broke it up <laughs> against the cage like this. And he this rammed it. <laughs> up Phil's asshole. Phil tried yeah. to escape and it broke. It off broke off. Did you read my latest screenplay? Because that's in one of the scenes. <laughs> You're <laughs> all breaking so off in a bleached asshole? No, like, uh, the main <laughs> character does an arm bar to uh, her ex fiance and uh, breaks the arm clear off and then rams it down his throat and suffocates what? it with them. It breaks clean what? off? Yeah. Does it? Does this. Yeah, I mean, there's like a fucking choke cold break where the neck goes 360 and the head being rolls shot? off. Like, you see the skin ripping? You know, like, oh. Yeah, I think the skin, skin's got to rip. It's going to be good. Yeah. You cut it with the bone, I guess. Cut it with the bone of the arm. Bone pops up, you know? That's, that's yeah. a spiral like fracture. Fucking down the throat with the bone, you know? Like, oh, blood coming out. And this is perhaps one of the most. It's a kid's movie. Verbally. <laughs> I just don't have a personal... Disney have picked it up. It's my first Disney film. I don't like or dislike either one of these fighters as this thing uh, as well. See, I yeah. love Glover, and I I'm hate right there everything with that I've just like, seen. I was like, I wanted Phil Davis to lose to Machida, and when he beat Machida, I was like, what? I was like, hello, what? Hello, That's what? weird. I'm eating some of your crust. I took, a, I took a shit on that piece of crust. This piece? I thought you just wiped with it. Oh, I just wiped oh. with it. You eat my crust. I, you know, All right, so the fight is over. over. Bill Davis and Glover look equally tired. And they look like they're about to make out. And they are. It's kind of like I'm long. like, he, he kind of, I think Phil just said it's it's cool because like, I'm like kind of like the blacker version of you or you're like the lighter version of me. That's, and he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he rubbed his head and they walked away. That's pretty much, I think, what he said. <laughs> It's about right on the spot. Yeah, he said, enough with the jokes, Phil. And Phil went, I'm not joking. He's like, what? And then they got separated. Yeah. And he says, I'm going to fight you now. And he says, that was what the last 15 minutes was about. And he goes, Mm. what? The last 15 minutes was about fighting? That happened? Look, all the highlights are from round one. Fuck, I missed it. Did you see round one? No. Um, Hi, Mom. Uh, Steven's mom. Mm. My mom doesn't watch. Steven's mom does. Well, I don't know if she There's watches. No, I, we don't know if anybody watches because this is a scientific experiment. Don, Don, 
in the 50s by two scientists of the one orthodox religion. We're trying to figure out if it's possibly black. Yeah, we don't, I mean, this might be not able to sync up. And, uh, and, but it, it might not need to be synced. Maybe we're loud enough. Maybe maybe we have some this sound. Is a, did, we are out we'll find on that. the edge of the earth we're right now. We're just fucking... We're like seriously looking the down. The palisades, we're actually floating 3,000 feet. I'm looking feet down right now and all I see is stars and like oh, you, fucking you space. I see a nebula. Yeah, on the edge of the earth, brother. I see Whitney Houston. Who's that? No. Oh, even her ghost is getting beat. Damn. <laughs> Damn, yo. Uh, While she's underwater. Uh, oh, she died. She drowned, huh? I don't know where I was going with that. Don't go chasing water. I don't condone violence towards women or other humans. Though. That's not what you were saying earlier. You're thinking about Mark Fletcher, who threw his girl down his flight of stairs, right? Or he kicked oh, her that's the right. Door. No, he. I kicked that Mexican kid. That was Carlos. Yeah. Oh, wasn't, didn't Mark, Mark was Carlos. trying to tell a redeeming Fucking story sorry. about himself. Where he threw a woman, threw down, a woman down a flight of stairs. Jesus, did he mean to? I mean, it I was think. like a joke thing that got serious. I don't know. And now are they still friends? I think, I think he she... said, "Oh, hey, you're a woman. There's a flight of stairs, and he's an opportunist." <laughs> <laughs> Do you think, like, maybe, like that, the invention of us being able to video fight pods might be like the death of it like it you know what i mean like it's like when silent movies turn into talkies you know it's like well, this like my movies kill. still exist if, if, right right but like certain actors at the time just couldn't fucking trans oh. they talk like that you know they had like yeah. weird voices or they didn't speak english or look at <laughs> us look at the three of us right now how can this not translate to video <laughs> you're right it fills on it we have to go back to just the original format. Because he's Cause got people a might have the idea that Phil's got looking because of his voice, but then when they see him, they'll be uh, <laughs> repulsed. Yeah. Yeah. He's pretty good looking now for mm-hmm. like a hipster, right? Like, <laughs> he looks like uh, Brad Pitt's asshole in Fury. Oh, have you seen it? <laughs> no. No, I mean the Brad Fu- Pitt's movie. asshole? No, the movie. No, I haven't seen the movie. He looks like. Brad Pitt, if he had a son and sold him to like the high desert. Do you think Brad Pitt secretly sells his own children just to collect S- more ones? new ones? Yeah, maybe he trades <laughs> yeah, in he trades children for, for other ones that are yeah. from farther distances. Yeah. And a harder reaches of the world to get to children from. Yeah. I think so. That would that makes the breakup between him and Jennifer Aniston even Oh, they broke up? Jennifer Aniston. When? Years ago, they were before like, Angelina yeah, Jolie. Yeah. But Jennifer uh, Aniston Kanye, always wanted Kanye or kids. Kanye McGregor. Kanye McGregor. Wait, they showed him for a second. They should change his name to Kanye McGregor. Kanye McGregor. He'd probably punch you ever said that in the mouth. Yeah, he'd be like, "That's not Irish enough." Is that how he trains? <laughs> they just pick each other up. Uh, Jose yeah. Aldo is picking up his trainer and dropping him. Yep. Yeah, he's practicing because he's gonna fucking dump Men- Melendez because he's the wrestler guy, you know. So he wants yeah. to fucking do Mendes. what Mendes. Jones Mendes. does. Mendes. He will, I don't give a shit what his fucking last name is. He's going to lose. He's fucking <laughs> Team Alpha. He's Faber boy. Alpha male is Faber. Yeah, and, and the Dilly Shaw. Shaw. Like, yeah, loser Shaw. Loser Shaw. <laughs> loser Shaw. Jesus Shaw. Jesus Shaw. Jesus Shaw. <laughs> I saw it there like, when Faber and Dillashaw fight when like their their gloves connect like a huge cross of lights can oh form. yeah are they gonna major... fight are they gonna do it I don't think so I think Dillashaw would rip Faber's asshole out why well, why would he <laughs> do that like it has nothing to do with fighting what is wrong with you <laughs> that's, that's nothing to like do with this sport whatsoever that's legal I'm he... moving a little hole further this way <laughs> do you want me to sit in your lap no <laughs> I just want to get away from this shit in his hand up my asshole. <laughs> I'm just like putting gross. a glove on. That's gross, you guys. Is this a video game advert? Yeah, this this is a video game starring... Um, oh, it's Assassin's Creed. Don't care. Um, Man, but let's talk about the UFC video game for a minute. It is, they keep making improvements. They keep, they, I they want to play it with yes, the fighters. With, they update with they, fighters. Yes, we need to play more. This is no, uh, a fact. sad. It needs to be a regular thing. Like, it, it just needs to be like, oh, well, it's Wednesday or whatever day it is, you know? Yeah. Like, we got to go to the gym, you know? So, What's but, your favorite fighter on the gym? Uh, well, I 
fight with McGregor a lot, but they recently added um, uh, Gunner Nelson, and I oh, really cool. enjoy fighting with him because he's kind of like a bigger but slower version of Connor, but it's right. heavier. Did, did he just win his last fight? Oh, he lost. lost. He and lost so does fucking our homie, the uh, the other Irish guy. Oh, fuck. He lost. What's his name? He lost. Uh, I'm forgetting his name right now. Damn it. But I love that guy. Like a charms guy. That's right. Like a charms. Yeah. That's a potato. Wait, is this happening? No. Bullshit. It's happening eventually. There's Chan Sung Young, the Korean zombie. Yeah. Yeah. But he's out two years minimum. Yep. Yeah. Well, Silver, he has two ten. years of military service to do. I didn't know Cub Swanson was two. If Conor McGregor's fighting anyone else in that division, it should be fucking Cub Swanson. Yeah, that'd be a good, a good slugfest, wouldn't it? Yeah, or anyone ranked higher than him. He's done in Dustin Poirier. Yeah, yeah looks good. Let me show the camera. Holy smokes! Oh, what the? Oh, oh that looks so cool. incredible. Oh, Wait, what is going on? Oh, uh, they're showing some previews. Oh, is that one the? That was that's the that Mendez out. Yeah. Remember when he ran into the crowd yeah. like you were saying? Was this in Brazil? I think it was. Yeah. Oh yeah, the new pizza cutter. Sponsored by Metro PCS, ladies and gentlemen. Metro PCS, pizza cutter. Here the cutter of pizza. He looks like a weight class down from Aldo. He just looks like it's so much smaller, you know? He's just a little... Little wrestler guy. A little wrestler dude. As Connor likes to call him. Has Connor referred to him as a midget? Yeah. Oh, I love that. Man, did you see what um, Connor... Uh, let me come on the Connor and um, Melendez were uh, on uh, some show. You can correct me, go ahead. Yep, Melendez. And Mendes. <laughs> Mendes. 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 And uh, Connor said that he would rest his balls on his head. Ooh. Like on live television. It was great. Oh, I'd rest my balls on his head. God. I'd rest my balls on his head. So, Brian is using the so Metro PCS sponsored pizza slicer to slice his pizza. Yeah, that's happening over there. If you, uh, if you can't see it, it looks a lot like this. And if you're just listening, I am miming cutting the pizza. So, I'm glad <laughs> we are all cleared up there. Hey, is um, there a difference between miming and cutting the pizza? Let me show them how big this thing is. It's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, it looks like a saw. Yeah, you can see the sh the, the, the show. I, I wish I could uh, say the, the same thing about my penis and just get on the camera and say, let me show them how big this is. Yeah. But I, uh, my mind went there as well. I can't claim that. Yeah. Um, All right, is so this Aldo doing his walkout? I had a realization the other day, fellas. No, this is Mendez. This yeah, is, uh, the champ goes last. I just thought I missed it because yeah. Mendez is so boring. <laughs> you thought you just died for I thought I just minutes. blacked out. Um, yeah, I had a realization the other day. What was your realization? Oh, it's, like that. All right. it's, it's quite a sad realization. Alright, uh, let me get ready. I realized I will never play cards with a penguin. Because it's just too difficult with the flippers. They can't hold a hand of cards. You had an opportunity to play cards with a thing? No, but uh, if I'm never going to have an opportunity to do that. Yeah. Well, we all have to reach That's that point of realization your, at some point. Your portions of the pizza. Since oh, it's beautiful. You know, so there's four slices. Yeah. Well, I can't ask for better hospitality. No, I can't either. I leave here. I can't believe. It's in the budget, you guys. I can't believe we used to, you know, have cast at the Los Feliz studio, and really, yeah, the Palisades have been so oh, we've good. We've come to so us. far. We have we've really come, come so, far. so far. We have come so far, you guys. So I'm gonna cry. It's okay, Brian. Okay. So me and um, Carmine took a trip to Santa, Mar Santa Barbara last week. Yeah. And for some reason, Carmine went on a tear of destruction with his mouth, and. Oh, uh, yeah. 
insulting everybody behind their backs to me. So just strangers. I, just strangers. I, I commented on this one guy at a bar that was with a rather pretty lady, and I said that doesn't kind of make sense because he looks like a horse that's just ran into a fence because he had a really long face. Okay. And Carmine said, "Yeah." If the fence had spikes and the horse had run into an asshole first. It's <laughs> taking it to a new level. I don't, I don't know. Every time, like, he's the know, nicest know. guy I know. Yeah. But every person we met. Just we something see, came out of me in Santa Barbara. We saw these two girls kiss him that really, I must admit, they thought they were hot shit. Like they, get, they looked over at us as if, are you watching us because we're hot shit? And we were both saying, oh wow, they're not hot shit. Mm. But Carmine, instead of just saying, oh wow, they're not hot shit. Threw up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Carmine yeah. said, I'd rather see Shamu rape another killer whale at SeaWorld than watch that. <laughs> <laughs> Normally people That's go to amazing. Santa Barbara and just taste wine and have a pleasant we time. We also did that. That was just Yes, like, but I was in the middle of the, of the winery program. going, shots fired, shots fired, because your lady friend had just insulted me. She did. Via text message. It was intense. Yeah. What did she say? Really? Oh, that the final sex was the best sex you had? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That is true. We uh, need not Steve explain. the Bible in Santa <laughs> okay. Barbara, then. Well, we're going to explain. <laughs> <laughs> Stephen, fuck the Bible in Santa Barbara. What else are you meant to do with the when Bible? I had like, relations give them in a hotel with... room. <laughs> I'm not going to read it. <laughs> what page did you fuck? All of them. Everyone. Flip. But you oh. can't turn to the page now because we're all stuck together. <laughs> <laughs> Makes sense. Mm. This pizza is artistic. It's delicious. It's delicious. It's Where? <coughs> the pizza's artistic or autistic? It's autistic. Yeah, autistic. I had the wrong vaccinations now just to know what ABC is. <laughs> But it can tell you what was the number one song in your birthday. <laughs> <laughs> True. I met the man that was the inspiration for Rain Man. Tom Cruise? Well, no, he's an autistic <laughs> asshole. I met a nice autistic person. Ah. And he was lovely. He did actually tell me what song was number one on the day of my birthday. What was it? I can't remember. Oh he, my if God. he was here right now, he'd be killing it. You, I, I mean, I did look it up, and it was you're right. You're not gonna find that. Oh, we can look it up. Well, I know what day I was born, and I have the internet. And he knew. I have the internet in England. Well, I'm over here in the Palisades. If I was back in England, I'd be fucked for all eternity. Yeah. <laughs> Requires electricity. <laughs> Glad we have you over here. Mm. And when you go back, you can tell him all the things you have. Hmm. Like four loco in Santa Barbara. Fubu. Fubu. <laughs> Obesity. <laughs> racism. Oh, you guys have that too. Come the Southern on. Gothic literary subgenre. A couple people at yeah. least. We gotta be fast. Oh, I was just there and I don't remember a fat person. Seeing both the walkouts, Aldo's gonna kill this guy. Mm, yeah. Who's winning? That guy? Nobody up. We haven't started, started yet. But this is the main event. Undefeated since 2005? Mm. Oh no. In 2005, cool. I still thought it was okay to eat at fast food places. He's been knocking people out at a champion level since then. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Didn't you eat at In and Out the other day? Oh, that doesn't count. It's In and Out. That's good. It's it really good. good. You eat In and Out? Mm. What do you eat? The, veg the uh, veggie burger or whatever? The grilled cheese, grilled probably. cheese animal style. That's what I do. Yep. I love the grilled cheese though. Mm -hmm. I love the animal fries. Mm -hmm. Is that with onions on the fries? Yeah. Sponsored by fucking In and Out. Hello. Hey, In and Out, our new sponsors. Thank you guys. Thank you guys. That's why you're eating pizza. And uh, this big fight is on now. The rematch. And the first one. Jose Aldo soccer kicks Melendez. It's like and he's in this position, and then he just goes doo, boom to the oh. back, and it's over. Done. Man, we are live. It was over. I think the same thing's gonna happen. I predict the same soccer kick to the face. 
That's the soccer like, kick. Yeah, knock him to the ground. That is one of the best highlights to do in like your knockout reels. Uh huh. I think Aldo might actually finish this fight just because I think Chad Mendes will take it to him more than other guys have. He'll force his hand. Yeah. Hmm. This round's sponsored by Bud Light, they said? Is that always the case? I don't remember mm. that. So this is a fight is sponsored by Bud Light. Uh, fight. They used to be sponsored by Harley. Mm. Uh, Connor did the Q&A down there in Brazil on the fans. It was pretty funny because they were just like, he's just, you know, going at them. They're going at him. He's like handling it, like, yeah. talking to him, you know, claiming he's the king, all that stuff. It was great. Oh, because it's in Brazil. Yeah. Mm. That's awesome. There's some spice, there's some kick, there's some there's arambiata some... to this pizza. Mm. Yeah, Jenny don't play when it comes to the, uh, the stove over there. Yeah, this is incredible. What world, though? This one? Not this one. Different one. Different one. Mate fit. I should specify that. There's a sponsor that's Mate Fit. Is that like... American English or like friend fit? Yes. Okay. It's about anal sex. Mm. Anal sex through the mouth? ATM? Anal sex through the mouth? Yeah, when you butt fuck the mouth. <laughs> it's been at least Sponsor 20 minutes since I've done that. Sponsored by the when you yes. butt fuck the mouth. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Does every mouth secretly have a butt? That's a hole. Of what? The branding? Undisputed? You've seen? Heavyweight? Oh, featherweight. That's gotta be the longest streak. 2005? I think it's the longest active streak, yeah. Yeah, I mean, all the other ones just died this year. Yeah. GSP? Silva? Melinda. That takes him back to when he was 19 years old. Yeah. Or uh, eight, 18. 2004? Holy shit. He didn't even look at him. He's going to lose. I was <coughs> losing for the first time. But he Six wasn't four. in the UFC because this weight class hasn't existed since 2000. Right. Uh, he's probably 2009 or something. I don't know. Look. Hoop. There it is. Shaka Laga, Shaka Laga. All right, so we go. Here we go. Round one. Main event. Aldo oh, Mendes. Chad Mendes throws the first leg kick. Chad Mendes is going straight in to try and knock him out, which could be the dumbest fucking thing he does if Aldo can counter right. What is he throwing Popeye? A little wind up. Hey, look how big Aldo looks. Yeah, we all knew that Melendez was going to try to come forward. Yeah. Come fast with a flurry. Oh. Whoa, look at that. Combination, Combination from Aldo. From Aldo. Oh, oh man. those Holy punches shit. look very scary. Like Aldo looks like he wants to actually fight for Actually, him. he looks, yeah, he looks like he's standing in the pocket taking those leg well, kicks. He's taking. And those are going to add up, as they but say. Mendez, I love that strategy of kicking the leg to try and take some power out of it to take the power out of yeah. Aldo's kicks. Oh, nice. Oh, oh what was that? Shot? I think oh, he that slipped. That was a left to the head. I was a slip, I though. think he could have slipped with it. Yeah, because he was up he was with the uppercut. Wow, Melendia is... Wow, okay, so we're watching these some, guys. Let's, let's talk about Connor. old Connor. Connor versus either one of these guys, because that's what we're talking about here. Well, I'd say yes if he hadn't just taken that silver fight, which seems dumb as fuck. Yeah, but he'll beat that guy. Yeah, but that doesn't, put that, him, that doesn't put him in line for a title shot. Yeah, but... He beats that guy, he has to fight somebody else. No, know. he doesn't. They, they, it's the, he fights it to get no rich. No one beats Dennis Silva to get a title shot. Well, he, he's already in line for it. He just wants the fight. So that's very noble. Oh, oh. oh God, that's embarrassing. Oh, Still going. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Still going, dude. Still uh, going. I think you can play with it out, but it's fun to I be able to so. look at it. It's us. fun to be able to look down and go, hi. You know that we're in frame or not in I'm frame. Still human. I haven't got the legs of a ram yet. I'm good. Mm. A That's ramule. pretty metal. Ramule. I might, ram name, legs. I might name a child Ramule. 
not my own, though. No. Man, it's some shots from Mendez. Yeah, man, Mendez is doing really well. I'm person. impressed with Mendez right now. A lot of respect. You know, he's going to lose. I'm not betting against Aldo. When someone's got a winning streak this as long as Aldo has, I'd never go against him. Okay, so if Melendez wins, he'll get the immediate title shot. And maybe Connor is like thinking or knows something. But he's saying that it's going to be him and Aldo because, like, you know, he's done a scrum Q&A thing. You know, he's been all over the, the, the Brazilian media talking about, you know, him being the next contender for one of these guys that he just is taking this get rich. Get rich. But he's going to get richer fighting these guys. No, I know. He's going to fight these guys. See, Aldo is now turning it on. And just kicked him in the dick, which is an illegal move. I mean, if you're trying to appeal to people who don't know anything about the sport, and Connor's like a name, you can't just have him beat up anyone and try and get more viewers. Is that part of it, too? I think, yeah, too. I think it's like... I just think that's I always know. silly in the fight game. Because as much as I love McGregor, who knows? Maybe it's a, what it's if a it's trick. What, what if Silver beats him? Yeah, but you, you I know. don't think it would happen. But it could happen. It's the UFC. Anything could happen. Anything can happen. But like, if he beats it's like him, being then in he's, a room with me, anything Pettis. could happen. If I could be licking him. your face. No, but if uh, that's weird. But uh, if he beats him, just then, he's, then he's Anthony Pettis. You know, Pettis loses to Guider. And then he, you know, when he was supposed to get the title shot, he took mm. the fight anyway. And it sets him back, you know, had to take more fights to get down that road. So, yeah. that's it. And if he can't fucking beat Dennis Silver, he has no business fighting one of these guys anyway. That's true. I just really Although want to see him. a solid eye poke there. Was that an eye poke? Yeah. I think that's just called a punch with a, an extended finger. <laughs> or an eye poke. Punch with an extended finger. <laughs> hey, is there well, any, just a punch with uh, an word on I Dominic Cruz after that, that win? He's got to be going for a title shot next Yeah, year. he's getting the title shot next That's so cool. Oh, that's going to yeah. be a good fight. Because yeah, he could have... Really, he's in that that's unique morale. position. Or Dilly Show. Dilly Show. Dilly. Uncle Dilly. Cruz is in that unique position where he could have got a title fight straight oh, away. Oh, look at these guys look going at Aldo is throwing Walking into Mendes. him and then Melendez is took him down. Oh, oh wow. Aldo gets pops up like back it's up. nothing. Aldo is pissed right now. Wow. Oh, oh Melendez is knocked down. He oh, is this it? dives in. He counterpunched him like he said. Yeah, this is going this to be it. Looks it looks like, like it. It was 32 gonna get out of seconds. seconds of the first hold on, That's a hold on, long Mendes. Fucking time. Hold on, Melendez. Oh, he's getting pounded. Oh, he's in full oh. mount. Do you see how easy it was for him to just do that to this? He's yeah, stronger. He's, he's way bigger. Mendez oh, is this, almost he's out. He's so fast. Well. I mean, Melendez is not going to make it. No. Oh, 15. Yeah, oh, he's oh, up. Shit. He wow. is not almost at the He's taking that up. kick to the head now. Yeah, but he wow. just. He doesn't have eyes. End of the round. Oh, see. Just, Aldo tried to throw that Irish there's... uppercut. Oh, oh my God! Saved by the I bell. I couldn't hear the bell. Saved by yeah. that was the bell that right there. Right hand was just after the. He doesn't know what corner to go to. Oh wow! Oh right. my God! That right hand I think was just after the bell. I mean, I think it was so close that Aldo didn't throw it illegally. Yeah, well, they'll, we'll get that replay to get the sound on that. I bet they'll give it to us. Yeah. If they're wise and I mean, that was a. Oh, he doesn't know where he is right now. He has no, no clue. They're going to do that. Okay, shh. Sh. Oh, oh that two was after. after. Fuck you, Aldo. Two. Two clear after. Yeah. Wait, what are the penalties for that? It could be a point taken, but... But uh, has anyone picked up on that? In, the, in Brazil, no. The problem is I wouldn't up. have been upset with the left hand. Like, that was thrown just after the bell. Yeah, and the He's second still, one. But the second one was just but like, he saw his opportunity to throw it fast enough. He might have already been in. I'd like to see the replay again. He might have already been in that motion of one-two punch him. combination. Yeah, it could have been. I'll but the benefit I don't think so. It seemed pretty late it to seemed. me. And that's going to be talked about in the media after the fight, sponsored by whoever. Yeah. Who the fuck ever? Lots supposed. of people. Yeah. Like wow. uh, we're like talking about energy drinks. I'll tell you, twat. Oh, and he went out and did a little hand dab to be like, "Oh, I'm sorry, I legally knocked you out for <laughs> split second, be hot." 
It's like watching a so golfer. Melendia it seems a little bit slower in his uh, yeah, bounce he's, around. He's well, yeah, he's wobbled. Yeah, he's trying to recover right now. It's, he's got fucking four more rounds to go potentially. He doesn't. And want he just to just you know, he doesn't need to be trying to fight him right now. No. He should just be like bouncing around. Yeah, like keep him. your distance. Keep throwing that leg kick. Stay away from him. I don't think that leg, leg kick's kick. gonna come as fast now. Is the problem? He seems like Let's he's getting. See what he like and Aldo that. should be going after him. Oh, the fact that he's be. not is like letting him rest is dumb. And he just took a dick kick. Aldo took a dick kick. Now cool. He's... Don't complain about the dick kick. He just knocked a guy out. After yeah, the after the bell. You really don't like Aldo, huh? I really can't stand him anymore. I I I'm indifferent. I liked him in the terms of he's. A, well, of who do you want to see? Who do you want to see? Connor versus Melendez or Connor versus Aldo? Connor versus Aldo is just a more epic fight. Yeah. yeah. So you know what I mean? Epic. It's yeah. just that's the man to take down a legend. Aldo's a legend. And yeah. I accept that. Yeah. I like Aldo a million times better than John Jones. If the two of them were on fire and I only had enough piss to put one of them out, I'd piss on Aldo. Wouldn't you just piss off to the side? <laughs> we are back in. Is this round two? Round two, four minutes left. Sponsored by Pichu Chi Chi Chi. Into a toilet. To this <laughs> um, and, uh, Mexican toilets. Men- <laughs> Mendez still buying time. Yeah, but no, but he's uh, not though. No. Aldo's not attacking no, him. Mendes Aldo is never attacks. Pressing. He's just he a, a counter striker. He knocked Mendez out because Mendez tried to, you know, fight him. Yeah, he's a counter striker, just like that. He throws yeah. the kick and he throws the punch to the face. Yeah. Mendez. That's what Steve Who's was saying. Mendez? That he, Mendez is going to press Mendez the issue. Mendez is the guy we've been called Melendez for the last 20 years. <laughs> Shit, he deserves it. <laughs> a little cunt. I mean, yeah, I'm not a big Mendez fan either. I just... Crowd doesn't seem to know he just slipped. Yeah, no, because he just fell. And they just, Aldous shouldn't do... He didn't take advantage of the moment at all. Oh, he laughed at him. Ha uh-huh, ha, because he get because that fucking kick hurt. That's why he laughs. You laugh when it hurts. Yeah, because he checked his kick. Yeah, no, no, um, he didn't check his kick. He just took it. Oh, he was Mendes like, is uh-huh. fucking around with him a little bit now. No, he's got. He's got. Aldo let him get back in the fight. Yeah. I really wonder and, how Connor would fare against these two. I idiots. really do. This too. is some really scary counter punching, though. Like really well, scary. Yeah. Both of them, it's clear Aldo can knock Mendez out. But the and problem, Mendez can knock out anyone in that weight class. His hands are freakishly heavy. The problem being a counter... Oh, wow, he's, got really, he's got speed back. He's got speed back. Mendez yeah. is back in it, sort of. Yeah, yeah he's, he, he's, he's still there. And we're he probably right doesn't there. mentally know he's back in it yet. He's just in, like, fucking time travel. He's though. in Guam right now yeah, with a prostitute. <laughs> yeah. He has no idea He's in, he like, is. an ABC sitcom now. He doesn't know. <laughs> he's in, he actually thinks he's at home playing the video game with himself yeah. right now. Because yeah, you know he's done that in Jacked Off. Playing with himself, one handed. Uh, yeah, it's a good controller. <laughs> I once, you know, ended up fighting with Melendez on uh, the video game. Yep. By accident, because he's right next to Connor, and I went like, live <laughs> into like a fight against somebody, and I was like, oh shit, like, <laughs> I don't know this midget, you know, I don't know his <laughs> It's just like so much more interesting than the last two Aldo fights I've seen now. Yeah, Millennius is a fun one to watch. He's got he's got that whole Dillashaw, Jesus, I'm really fast and I bounce around and I suck attitude. What, do you know, know where he trains anybody? With yeah, those with freaks. Yeah, his team Alpha favorite. Dog was him right now. Yeah. He looks like them too. So yeah, alpha like man. unclean. They go through and like high school yearbooks. So like, this, guy, guy, this guy's a fucking American. Let's get that American looking guy. They're so pretty and American looking. It's so weird. Mm. They're like the best looking Christians that walk the earth and they destroy fucking people for Jesus. It's like a crusade. <clears throat> Training fighters. The new crusade. Do God's will. They should just call themselves the Crusaders. Yeah, that would be kind of fun. <sighs> Team Alpha Dog just sounds like, you know, the biggest guy in the prison block or something. It's not even cool enough to be called Team Alpha Dog. It's Team Alpha Male. 
Oh, it's alpha male? Oh, he took oh. a kick to the face, and he's trying to shake it off. I thought he put his hand up. Oh, he, he got a little toe to the Wait. cheek. A little toe to the cheek? Wow, Millennials came in at a terrible angle that was like a Z shape that just was like fucking foreshadowing, foretelling, and then... Telegraphing. Aldo telegraphing. Aldo came in at such a beautiful angle underneath that was this like short and sweet. Oh, uh, Aldo landed something. Got a good tag on it. Who won round two for you? Uh, I don't know. I actually don't know either. I would say maybe Melendi is by fucking fraction, just like because just he, he was, was dancing pressing. around more and he was pressing. Yeah. That's that's where I would stand on that. I mean, I'll go one round one. Oh, sure. Yeah. Does he have any damage on him? What's your damage? Sorry, I just wanted to get that out. <laughs> What's your saying? damage? I feel like I that's an old saying. What's your damage? Yeah. I was like, well, from the silence of maybe broken home. Maybe in the 80s they would, like, you know, but it would be like, so it would be like saying, like, what's your problem? What's your damage? Yeah, like, what ails you, friend? Like, you might be at the mall or something like that, you know, and some... Meeting by the like, machine. And you're a chick, you know, with your other chick friends, and, like, some, like, dude, frat dude guy's, like, hitting on you or whatever, and, like, you really like him a lot, and you want to fuck the shit out of him, but you don't want your friends to know that. And when he's, like, saying, yo, yo... Carmelina, you're really beautiful. You're like, what's, what's your, your damage? damage? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's like that. Oh, we're into Go this fight. Go back to Sunglass Hut. <laughs> Go back to the Sunglass Hut, you boo. <laughs> Dope. I'm still Jenny from the block. You said a little how I have a fucking lot. Wait, so you think Mendez actually won that round? I he can theory do that the rest of the fight. Oh, uh, another eye joke, Pope. He's like, what the fuck? Well, go after him next time. Don't just lay down and cry because your eye hurts and you're... Are they going to take a part off him? He's, he's going for it, isn't he? I hope his eye is actually missing. Oh, wow, yeah, he got him in the eye. I hope his eye is gone and the fight's over. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's it. He just Pine looks towards the camera. There's just, just like this black and red hole. Like, wow. Yeah. Well, what does a point do in a five round fight? Takes one away. Right, but still. In a fight where Al, we're just waiting for Aldo to knock it out. makes it a four round fight? Well, it's like. If it's, it kind of yeah, gives you that. Kinda, yeah, alright. If Mendez won the second round and he was to win this round, yeah, no, I get also it. Be like, not stupid. But our listeners <laughs> might not know. Our listeners know. might be half retarded. Viewers I mean, might yeah, not know this. Listening to us on a Saturday. Uh, uh, Mendez so probably is just not out of control. Yeah, probably not. Mendez pressing forward. He's trying. You can't knock a guy for trying. Aldo just tagged him in the face a couple times there. Did he connect now? Yeah, he did. I promise you. He got in there at least one. And he got a good body shot in on him, too. And he uh, slept with his sister, too. <laughs> and called his mother a dirty whore. Yeah. While he was sleeping with his sister. This is interesting, though. I've never seen Aldo be, like, and challenged. So I've never seen him have to fight. Well, it's kind of new. Mendez still isn't scared of going forward. I mean, he's getting in and out quick, but... But is he he's, he's not, not doing anything this round so far. He's, he's losing this round so far. I mean, not yeah. that Aldo's done much, but I think he's landed Aldo a little bit more. Aldo will win it because he's the champion as yeah, well. Yeah, that's true too. And if it's that close, Aldo's going to win the round. Oh, wow. Look that's at that a punch to his face. Yeah. And that's a nice duck of and a... This is where Mendez needs to just... Yeah, this is where Mendez is too Mendez needs short to circle stocking. around. Get and out of that position. Oh, bam, bam. Couple to the face. Ooh. Aldo's scary, You know, man. the problem... I like him, but he's scary. Melendez is when Aldo fights, I love him. When he shows up to fight, yeah, you see the glimpses of what got him to where he is. He's one of the best. Yeah, but Melendez, when he throws a punch, he has to move his whole body because it's like he's so stiff. Yeah. It's like telegraphs every punch because it's like, yeah, he was fast for the first round and a half, but he's not. He's a normal fighter right now. Or is that the feed? 
It might be the theme. It could the be the glitching. theme. Ignore everything <laughs> we've said tonight. I think Glover Teixeira won the last fight. I think yeah. he did. <laughs> but how did he win it, though? Fucking Phil Davis is like to death. Did Phil Goal Davis win? I forgot. Yeah, he did. He did. By what? Knocked him out? Unanimous no, decision. Oh, just pounded him out. No, no decision. decision. It was pounded him out. It was a really decision. boring fight. That's why it was tried to get it. That's like the remember. whole. We just we ate bread I the whole time. I wish I didn't remember. No, you should yeah. have smoked weed with me. Is that <laughs> did somebody just land something? Oh, oh, He's yeah. He hit wild. Yeah, he was, a, Larry, he was pulling a little Anderson Silva wobble, faking it. He was faking it? I think he might have been. Oh, oh wow. He took it to the ear. That's behind the ear. That's the hurtful one. That's the flying knee. Damn, it's really That's... hard to get Mendez out, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, but he might succeed here. No, oh, no. Right Aldo's tired. He's he... very tired. Yeah, Aldo's gassed as fuck. Look, his mouth's wide open. Yeah, but uh, but oh, Melendez no. is just covering up because he's, he's a mess. Mendez is like I'm just... just... I'm enjoying just keep this hitting stuff. the ear. Keep hitting the mm-hmm. ear. Mendes yeah. has to move now. He's at that point where... But Aldo has got to keep punching him in the ear. But he's got to, like, get his breath back, oh, too. Oh, he teed him oh, up. Oh, 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 go. oh. Wow, he certainly barely... Oh, 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 my God! Mendes. Melendez just picked him up, didn't really get anything out of it. Great but, defense. Well, he got but... Aldo not punched him in the face. Yeah, he, yeah, yeah, he got his yeah. <laughs> position, but I'm just saying, like... I didn't think he was going to have that power. It was where I yeah, was to shocked. pick him up like that. Is there much potential in the foot stomp move there? There's, um, I think so. It just, it hurts, you know? It, it's annoying, it hurts, it, uh... Um, goes off your concentration. And, it, you know, if you probably get the right stomp, it probably could break a bone in there, I'm sure, you know? Why not? Yeah, that would hurt me. That just looks scary, watching I mean, it. since I've been skateboarding again, you know, like, it's it's insane, like, because I, I, you know, much older than I used to be. But I go through injuries now. Like I have, like, you know, like I fall and I get, I get hurt, and, and it's pretty damn fun. It feels good to have like these oh, sores like and it. bruises and stuff. I took a brick wall on yeah. Wednesday. Were you drunk or just having fun? basketball? basketball. Oh, and I nice. shouted, "Shake it off, Carmine! Shake it off!" <laughs> yeah, it's exactly like how it sounds. The sideline. Dude. What a round indeed! I gotta, oh, yeah, do you know about this. Goldberg? Mike Goldberg? Goldberg? Yeah. What? No. He, um, last week, I guess it was last weekend. Oh, he did an NFL game. He did his first NFL game. Yeah. And he t- and called he it terribly. And then he, like... Why? Why did he... I mean, like, what? he for called... He, called he was Polish? calling wrong downs, wrong cut teams, wrong, wrong players, players, wrong everything. Like, it was so bad. Like, you could find it on YouTube where it's just him, like... There's a Fucking montage up. of it. Which and it's channel? Just like, I remember it was a Fox. Or like, oh, God, it's horrible. Like, who and, he then, and then he, he, you know, he got bashed on Twitter. And then he goes on Twitter like, and just like, says some like, pretty fucked up shit. And then I think lost, to, like, lost the job at Fox. <laughs> lost, you know, or whatever. No way. Oh, yeah. Was like, it yeah. NFL? NFL shite. Yeah, because he's called college games before. He calls the lingerie game every year, I guess. He just must. He should only do the lingerie game. Yeah, but why did they just have him do it? Like so they were coked up or something, man. Yeah. I don't know why. I like Mike Goldberg though. I do mean, too. He's, he's still like, doing this, right? He's like the friend you can make fun of. Focus the Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just Joe Rogan's punching bag. Yeah, there. he is. Round four championship rounds. Oh, wow. Oh, Melendez with the fucking weird front kick. Melendez still has some he power. He still pushes. Off. I will give Mendez full respect in this fight for pushing forward like I thought he would. Who won that last round, though? You got to go Aldo, yeah. Yeah, Aldo won it. Just making sure. He's like chanting Aldo. T- chanting I'm Aldo. Praising like the, Mendes, like the I'm footwear not... store? Like at the <laughs> mall? Yeah. You know, like shopping. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, footwear shopping. Aldo, no, it's where you buy like you know nice shoes. What footwear shopping? Is where you buy nice shoes. And Aldo. Oh, Aldo, the shop. Yeah. It's like his family fortune is there. Yeah, maybe he's just this like oh. super rich kid. He's a cobbler. He's actually a robot from the family. Aldo's he's not like really doing anything in this round. Well, he doesn't until he starts getting challenged. It seems yeah, like. that's yeah. what's been the whole fight. When Mendez just mm-hmm. opens I'm himself check up. Check the uh, Metro PCS uh, stat page and see. Oh, Metro PCS, Metro PCS. Go to the live Metro stat PCS. 
Metro, Metro, Metro PCS. Bum, bum. But, um, well, you what was your pick for this around. fight, Brian? Did you have Aldo in what round two? Like, usually? Let's see. This doesn't seem to be working. Um, I, I, uh, oh, huge uppercut from Mendez. Did not land. Aldo is just too fast. Fight rhythm. Oh, decent, decent kick. Even without the point deduction, Aldo is going to win this fight if it goes to decision. Yeah. So, At it's like moment, if, if yeah. Mendez gets a lucky shot, right? That's what we're wondering. Yeah, but I think he's proven enough that it wouldn't just be like one lucky shot. What's, what, what is that? Aldo's he's taunting him. He was complaining about a headbutt? I didn't see that. Yeah, it's coming out of his eye almost like a bloody tear. Yeah. On Aldo's left oh. eye. Something out of a horror film. So it's gonna be just like GSP fucking Hendrix. He's gonna oh, lose yeah. and be fucking. I've got Aldo in decision. Come on. That's what I, that's what I would have picked. I think that's what everyone in the world would have picked. <laughs> Even the Brazilians. So we're in round four. Two minutes to go. I think it's two rounds to Aldo, one round to Mendez, and I think Mendez is winning this round. Yeah. Oh. Two minutes left. Aldo just hit it. Man, I've spilled the wine. I've spilled the wine. It's okay. Everybody just spilled the wine. It is chaos. Gotta move the blank. Gotta move my legs. Uh, There we go. It's it is the, chaos in the studio. Yeah, it's just on the tile. Yeah. Aldo is dead. Can I have some for my legs? Yeah, sorry. Let me grab some more. Cool. It's more exciting than the fight. This is more exciting than the fight. Of wine on the shoe. He's afflicted with wine of the shoe. You always dab. You never rub. This is what I have learned from people coming over to my apartment and spilling wine on my floor. Who, who's done that? No, but he could be sat on this couch. <laughs> he looked right at, yeah. at you. That is embarrassing. I'm, I apologize, everybody at home. That was embarrassing. By well, me. the... Uh, oh, the feed. Do we right back? Our feed. Well, the feed. The feed. Oh, Jesus. Everything's going wrong. Every, everything has gone awry. Yeah, Just, you got to shake them out of this one here. Be working. Oh, my God. <laughs> Everything <laughs> is failing. We don't know what happened. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Superstar. Honestly, this is a tragedy, a full tragedy in a... The history of fight pods right now. My but God. We're still killing it with dialogue. We're still alive. I'm still cleaning. We're still and alive. We're cleaning. Our, our feet is completely really dead. What you gonna do? <laughs> I mean, this is the worst tragedy in the history of fight pods crashes ever. Ladies and gentlemen. Never a huge go. crash. Always Today we're with us. Stay dabbing. Once was white is now red. We the are best wank of your life. <laughs> moving towards getting <laughs> us back up online here, ladies it's and gentlemen. It's a premium wank. Stay with us here in the Fight Pod studio. Stay with us. We're here. Oh no, that's uh, the same issue that I we were be having here. before. I will be shimmying. We are for moving. Your amusement. Keep shimmying back there in the background. My partner, Stephen Evitz, is shimmying. It's the Palisades. Oh my god, you spill wine and it's all hell breaks loose. This fight could be over. We have no idea what's going on. 
Bear I'm with this. Over. Oh my god, Look this one this. looks to be a mess too. This is rock and roll. Everything I'm is just a mess trying to find the, Reset the old feed here as we've just lost. Resetting. Oh, I hear it some audio. Aldo. We hear uh, oh. audio is coming in. Oh. Oh. And we're back. Oh. And we are back. And live we're back. And it's studio. not over yet. It is in round five. The round five just started. The beginning started. of round five. There so we, we missed nothing but the end of round four. And you miss nothing with that fucking so, mind as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Okay. All right, back to the um, back to the studio. There's something that's strange. <sighs> I'm on it. Don't worry. I know where your last one went. I have it half of it in my shoe. Good. <laughs> I did that on the plane home from Look London. Look at Aldo's face. Oh, you did? Oh, right in my lap. Or whiskey right in my lap. What was the last time you guys saw Aldo's face in Rear Inch? Oh, it's been a long time. Um, it's been a long when, time. When I, uh, I don't like to talk about this in public, but I did run into him on the street and he was a real dick. Wait. Aldo. Wait. We have a special guest in the yeah, studio, special. <laughs> all the way from Brazil. He's a famous Brazilian announcer. He's calling the fight here for us for the last, for round. The last round. We can Just only the... afford him for one round. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. We put out. We put a lot of money into this show. Yeah. Um, his name is his Cristiano name. Ronaldo. Yes. Uh, and, uh, he's Portuguese. He's Portuguese, he's not Brazilian, he just speaks yeah. Portuguese yeah. because he's Portuguese. Aldo yeah. is up and he just shoved Melendez across the room. Yeah. I want Mendes. He's like, quit trying to end this fight. Just fucking hit him with a right now, just to freak everyone out. Like And, and like and, and have his like face crush in. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, he's landing those. Oh, no. Oh. This is a child abuse. Now uh, punch him in that neck. Aldo's on top of Mendez against the cage. Brian wants to after know. landing. Are you doing the translation? Yes. Um, of the uh, I, Brazilian fellow? While you guys were cleaning, I struck a deal with Ronaldo. Oh, very nice. And I thought you were going to say, whilst we were cleaning, you learned Portuguese. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you read one book. Yeah, I read. think you're an authority on everything. It's pretty amazing. Brilliant. This is why we have Carmine on the pods. Yeah, he is the smartest he's member of the speed translation. Well, as much uh, as he's a cunt, he can learn languages very fast. Quickly. Quickly. Johnny on the spot with the languages. How'd this fight devolve into like a normal Aldo fight? He just did. He just did. Oop, there it is. Oh! oh. Well, he just, you know. Cause he saw that coming and we didn't. Oh, wobbled a little bit. Aldo is exhausted, though. Yeah. It's nice to see. So is the Melendez. This is the best Aldo fight I've seen since the last Mendez fight. Yeah, pretty much. When he did that soccer kick and knock yeah. out from forwards to backwards, it was beautiful. All right, do it again. has gone quiet. Oh, man. Just go in, Aldo. Just go in. Just break Mendes. out your finest Just wingtip shoe. fucking overhand right, right now. 90 seconds left in this fight, peoples. You've got to go at it for these last... When that minute marker hits, I want to see just some fucking arms and fucking legs. Oh, down. take it down, it. Aldo. Oh! oh shove to the ground, dick kick. Aldo's like, he kicked me in the dick. The ref's like, no, he didn't. Look go like fight. He, did. he is well, obviously he didn't. not phased. That's why they're still fighting, Steven. What a weirdo. I don't get it. Wow. You said what a weirdo about Aldo, not me. I don't know. I'm saying that. I don't know. I'm still translating. I don't know. There's anything. too many voices. Too many voices. How many voices do you listen to? I've got you two, the Brazilian geezer, and the fucking 25 in my head. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> There's so many voices going on right now. Well, last 30 seconds of the fight. Mendez, you expect to see some oh, kind yeah, of. 30 seconds and nothing's happening. You're right. Fuck off, sheep. I don't want your wall. 29 mm. seconds. It's alright, Steve. Okay. Do you think Melendez is dead? does Melendez think he's done enough to win this fight? I don't, yeah, know. I don't think he knows. The thing is, technically anything. speaking, I know we saw all of round four, 
But um, I have Mendez winning two rounds, and this one's pretty split. Oh, I don't know. Aldo's trying to throw stuff. But he hasn't done enough to win the fight. No, and the point was taken. But man, Aldo's face was it, is It wasn't off. taken, was it? He said, if you oh. do it again, I'm going to deduct the point. Okay. If the point was taken, it's definitely Aldo's fight. Aldo looks like he lost in his mind. And his face is just looks like a... Like an autistic kid was playing with Mr. Potato Head and put all the pieces on wrong. <laughs> yeah, he does. He looks like Mr. Potato Head. Oh, yes. That's, that's well, should we end the show before we find out who won, or just to change up the format? Just to change up the format? Just fucking end it? Oh, yeah, he got I in think, there. I think, uh... They're just knocking each other off balance, though, you know? I think they're not maybe, like knockout down, knockdown. I said we re Oh, one my device. goodness. That one was. What do you want to reconvene? I was going to say we recap the evening, but oh. not about the fights. Just about what, what did you do before you arrived at the studio? Um, well, I never. I didn't vote vote for George Bush, uh, senior or junior. Neither you mean terms. neither? None, none. So that's one thing. No, I, I didn't have do. a choice in the matter, but I wouldn't have. I didn't do that. Um, but before fights, I watched some of the prelims. <laughs> And uh, I uh, made deals with the studio to rearrange it and film us. Right. Nice. And yeah. uh, what? Very recap. Oh, what about yourself, Conway? I had rare beef steak pho. Oh, nice. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck it was yeah. delicious. And a spring roll. It looks like Aldo won. They haven't said yet. They haven't said yet. They're just what? They're just hugging. Oh, was... the decision time is coming. My mistake. Oh my and god. And I would love to share more stories about my journey before the evening. But what was I still what was Elder talking to Favor about? Oh, who do you think won? Because they were having a They're gonna raise Aldo's hand. Do you think it is deserved? I think it was split. I think it was pretty much a draw. Do you think they call a draw? I think Mendez maybe had. I Here want to see go. something like a draw. I think they definitely see. had two rounds each, and I think. Still. Yeah. yeah. Jose Aldo wins. Yeah. Did they say it was unanimous? It sounded like it was unanimous. It was unanimous. Mm. They might have just given different uh, points for it. There you have it. He, he did win. You yeah, know? He, did. he did. It was just so close that if it wasn't a title fight, I would not know who won. Right. You gotta kind of win the title. You gotta be a little yeah. decisive to take a belt away. And yeah. that's close. And like uh, that's not as controversial as the GS. Are they gonna bring Connor in? You think? I wish. Yeah. yeah. Bring in McGregor. Bring, bring in, in McGregor. McGregor. Bring in McGregor. I'm looking for him. Bring him in. I know all of you care so much. The NBA season starting. Get out. Hmm? This is five points. We're talking about fights and racism and nothing else. <laughs> Only those two? <laughs> <laughs> what about Conor McGregor? Stop. You know, I see Dana in there. Is Conor right there next Come to him? On, I can't see. Uh, if Connor's in there, we will keep recording through the Connor interview. Yeah. That is for sure, people at home. I mean, no, it's not Connor. It's another asshole. Another asshole. Back in the day when guys used to just run the stage anyway, regardless of who the fuck wanted them in there. That's what I miss. Where's Connor? Can you translate for his combine? He's saying my goal was to make sure the fight wasn't interesting, but Mendez <laughs> kept insisting on making it interesting. <laughs> so they decided to do that. So I decided to win and to beat him enough just before it got interesting. 
There we go. Come on the translator in the studio. We couldn't afford a real translator, so we've got come. I could. I just didn't want to spend my money on it. God. That's true. I'm rich. Oh, here we go. Who do you want to fight next? Whoever the UFC tells me to fight. That's what he's saying. I want to take a vacation. I can beat anyone. Why he left? Oh, I was talking about Connor. Oh. He's a king chest. He's a Connor McGregor. He's a joke. Where is they going to bring him in? We don't want to hear what you oh say. Oh, my God. Who cares? Like what does he get? What does he get that for? I know. He can't even go to Disneyland, but he can fight in the UFC. <laughs> This is the world we live in. It would be so interesting to see McGregor out of fight. Oh my god. Just stylistically. And what do you think about Conor McGregor? <laughs> No, you don't know what the hell is going on because you got knocked out of the, of the round there, Sonny. I hate him less now. I don't mind him. Oh, don't do that. I like how he fought in this fight. You gotta give respect to him, Oh, right? yeah, yeah, sure, that's fine, but I don't know. I say human, I'd still piss on him. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. That's just because it's your thing, though. you. I like to piss on people. What well, I keep talking room. about Conor McGregor, Kanye McGregor for? Kanye McGregor. Fight for! <laughs> 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 <laughs>